Since 1875, French painter Jules Tavernier came to Monterey. It has been an art colony ever since. In 1969, negotiated with the city of Monterey and moved into a building. It became the art museum we know today at 559 Pacific. MLK School of the Arts here in Seaside. We are a turnaround art school, which is a program through the Kennedy Center. And the foundational belief of that program is taking the arts and using them to improve low performing schools. And a big part of uh, taking that leap into the arts education for our site is our partnership with the Monterey Museum of Art. Watercolor. Do you see how it, yeah, it kind of like disperses and it's kind of like a light. Color, and right? we coordinate really every cool single child to go to the museum every year and they'll do everything from the California landscapes to the photography to the sculpture workshop, which is new. And they get to go and experience art within a museum, which I think is very important for our kids to be in front of real paintings, real artwork, be able to have higher levels of conversations, analyzing artwork with docents in each other. And then also they get to go downstairs and they get to make the art themselves. They get to be a part of the art making process which really empowers them. And the only way we could do that, get our kids from Seaside into a museum in Monterey, is if the museum funds our transportation. So with that partnership, the financial contribution of paying for our buses to go to the museum enables our kids to be able to access that high level quality artwork. They just get excited about art. They're excited about the terms, about learning um, about local artwork, which is exciting. I think another great thing that the museum does is give every child two passes when they finish a field trip, which honors another visit and gives them an opportunity to bring their families. I love the Monterey Museum of Art. I, I, I made a clay cup and a dragon. And it's part of what has been the arc of the organization for 60 years in terms of its mission, and it's what we do. So a lot of times they come in with not a lot of knowledge, and they're very excited, and then they go out with a little more knowledge, and they're really excited. You want to come back? Yes! yes. Really? Yes. yes! How soon? Like very tomorrow! tomorrow. 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 <laughs> Every day. Yeah. Yeah. As we all know, we need to raise funds to stay to stay alive and to keep our lights on. Here we are totally dependent on philanthropy, donor dollars, large and small, for the past, the present, and also the excitement that we have ahead and that you will, we'd like to invite you to be a big part of our future.